entire terms is a procedure sometimes needed in addition to subtraction. It's the opposite of reducing fractions to lower terms. In reducing, we used common divisors. In raising fractions, we use common multipliers. Let's take a look. To raise a fraction to higher terms, simply multiply the numerator and denominator of a fraction by a common multiple. For example, if we want to raise the numerator and denominator of the fraction by factors of 7, multiply the numerator and denominator by 7 as you see here. It's important to remember that the value of the fraction has not changed by raising it. We've simply divided the whole into more parts. Here are the steps to raising a fraction. Step 1. Divide the original denominator into the new denominator. The resulting quotient is the common multiple that raises the fraction. Step 2. Multiply the numerator and the denominator of the original fraction by the common multiple. Here's an example. Raise the following fraction to higher terms as indicated. 2 thirds to 15 ths. In this example, we're raising the fraction 2 to the denominator 15. Divide the original denominator 3 into 15. This yields the common multiple 5. Now multiply both the numerator and the denominator by the common multiple 5, where 2 times 5 is 10 and 3 times 5 is 15 for 10 over 15. Sometimes it's difficult to determine which of the two fractions is the larger or smaller number. By converting them to like fractions, the same denominator, the answer will be evident. 